Hey guys, welcome back to another one. This is another Theta update video. And if you like this content, please like and subscribe to the channel. It does mean a lot. And one more thing, at the end of this video, there will be a giveaway. Uh, so make sure you stay tuned to the end of the video. And this video, we will be going over how to mint a Theta token on the Theta blockchain. It's actually very quick and easy, and I'll show you guys how to do this. And you can check out the timestamps below if you want to fast forward past this and get straight into the tutorial. But I thought first and foremost, we would check out the Medium article and I'll kind of read through this and then we will uh, mint the token. Uh, so here it is, the Theta ecosystem continues to expand with the release of the Theta token minter. With the Theta token minter, any user can create a a new TNT20 token on the Theta blockchain with no smart contract experience needed. They actually make it really, really easy, and we'll uh, walk through that here in a second. You just need to know the name, ticker symbol, and uh, decimal number, and the uh, supply parameters of the new token. And the uh, Theta uh, token mentor will take care of the rest. And this opens the door to a lot of uh, new, you know, uses for the Theta token. This came out in 2020, um, but you know, it still applies today, and I'll show you why. And you can use it for dApps and uh, much, much more. So Theta tokens, or actually uh, tokens, can be created with uh, either a permanently fixed supply, which we will do, or with the ability for future tokens to be minted depending on your token's use. And uh, we'll walk through all of these, you know, photos here in a second. So TNT20 tokens can be added to the Theta Wallet Chrome extension and downloaded here. And I'll put that link in the description below uh, to store alongside your Theta and T-Field tokens. Just enter your new token smart contract address, ticker symbol, and number of decimals. Support for TNT20 tokens will also be added to the Theta mobile wallet and web wallet in the coming updates, which it is there now. Um, you can also view your contract using the Theta Explorer. And this is important because, uh, especially with this one in particular, this coin that we're going to create together, or token that we're going to create together, if you want to see you know how many tokens are sitting in my wallet because i will be giving away all of these coins except for one i'm going to keep one myself um you know you can see you can see who i'm sending it to who's receiving these coins if i'm just hodling them all and so on and so forth so to view uh and query the uh, smart contract parameters use the source code for a generic tnt20 token from the github here and you know all of this is open source which is great um, I love it. And it's unlike, you know, uh, the regular Wall Street where you can't really see, you know, what banks are doing with your money, what, you know, these large companies are doing with your money. But this is all open source. And I think this is a great way for us to kind of experience that together. So TNT 20 tokens are just one of many use cases for smart contracts coming to the Theta ecosystem. And then uh, check out smart contract docs here and stay tuned for more releases uh, coming, which is this year now, 2021. All right. So that is the medium article, which kind of walks you through how to do it. All right. Here we are at the Theta token mentor. And once you first get here, you are hit with two different options. You can either create a fixed supply TNT 20 token or a mintable TNT 20 token. And I'm going to do the first one, which means the uh, total supply of your token is created on deployment, making the supply fix. If you want to do a mintable, um, the initial supply is created on contract deployment, but um, only you can add more tokens later. So you have the option, if you just want to create 100 now, you can create 100 later, and then, you know, 1,000 after that, or, you know, however much you'd like to. But I do want to create a fixed supply. I think there is something with fixed supply, kind of like Bitcoin. There's only a set amount, which makes it somewhat scarce. And the set amount, which I'll get to in a second, is only going to be 100. So it, there is going to be 100 of us token holders um, here in the future. And I'll walk you through that. After you select fixed supply, then you have to um, enter the token attributes. And the attributes are gonna be the name, the symbol, the decimal places. I'll just say 18 is the standard, so we won't change that. And then the initial supply. So the name, uh, you can have three to 25 symbols, and you can do alphanumeric characters, spaces, and hyphens are accepted. For us, we will do uh, crypto elite, and then the token symbol is three to five characters. Um, similarly, you can uh, think of like ETH, uh, BTC, 
um, no spaces, and then only alphanumeric characters. And for us, it is going to be the Crypto Elite token. So CET is going to be the symbol. Uh, I'll keep 18 uh, the way it is, and then the supply, the initial supply and only supply, it's only going to be 100. And then I will hit next. And then just confirm for token creation. It's a fixed supply. The name is Crypto Elite. The token symbol is CET, 18 decimals and 100 uh, tokens. And then we'll have to confirm this in the uh, Theta web wallet. Here is the contract. It's sending transaction to the Theta blockchain. It'll be a couple seconds. And then for the Theta web wallet, you need 40 T fuel at the time of this recording in order to mint a token. All right, there it is. So now we can check this out. Uh, we can view on the Theta Explorer. And here is the transaction detail, the hash. It's a smart contract. It was finalized today. And uh, the gas price was a fraction of a T fuel. Um, T fuel burnt was about six. And there is all of the contract information right there. So now if we go to the wallet, um, I can add a token, enter the contract address, which should be copied. If not, I'll just copy it right now just to make sure. We'll add token, contract address. The symbol is Crypto Elite Token. And then there is 18 decimal places. And there it is, this contract. I have all 100 right now. And kind of like I mentioned at the very beginning of this video, for the first 25 people who, uh, if you're interested in the Crypto Elite Token, uh, drop your public address into the description below and I will send 25 tokens to the first 25 people who drop their address in the uh, description below for the video. And if you guys are interested in this content, please like and subscribe to the channel. It does mean a lot. And once again, we went over how to create a, a TNT20 token on the Theta blockchain. See you guys on the next one.